Hello, today I will be making silver nitrate from a bar of pure silver. Doing this requires silver to be dissolved in and reacted with nitric acid. This process is sped up if the silver is in a fine dust or shavings. I decided to turn the silver bar into shavings by drilling into the bar with a handheld drill. As you will see later, this made the reaction start and end very quickly. Drilling enough shavings does take a while though, so if you plan to make a large amount of silver nitrate, I recommend just using the form the silver is already in and waiting a while longer for it to react if it is in a bar or a coin. So at this time, the amount of silver shavings I had looked good. So I decided to weigh it out into a beaker and it weighed perfectly 2 grams. So the next obvious reactant for silver nitrate is nitric acid. For the 2 grams of silver shavings I had, about 7 milliliters of 50% nitric acid should be the correct amount. When reacting metals with nitric acid, a high amount of water is needed to dissolve the nitrate salt that forms against the metal or else the nitric acid will have no way to reach with the metal and the reaction will come to a halt. Be sure to do this either in a fume hood or outside because the reaction forms nitrous oxide which could severely harm you. When the acid is added, the reaction starts immediately and you will notice the silver turn a darker color with little bubbles forming and potentially a brown cloud inside the beaker or flask. Step after all the silver has reacted and dissolved is to let the leftover acid and water evaporate. This can be done over time in a fume hood or over low heat on a burner or stove top. The remnants from the solution should be a white or slight brown powder of silver nitrate. 